Carlos, Brooklyn Freud and Slover. I'm at my home away from home, Twisted Lily, with Carla, who just got her hair did. Hi. It looks beautiful. Thank and you. Krista, Hi. how are you today? I'm good, how are you? I'm great. Good. It's beautiful out today. We tried to do this last week, but we had the sillies and it just it didn't happen. So I'm back here again this week. I'm very happy to be here. Yes. They got some new stuff in and they're gonna run us through it, run me through it and yeah. uh, here okay. we go. What do you got? So new effective studio. Mm -hmm. Still life in Rio. Okay. Amazing. Um super tropical, delicious. It has this um sort of like tangy, juicy mm -hmm. you no, know? and then it's got sort of this like bite yeah. from the ginger. And, yeah, and then there's some mint in there and some um, actually like hot pepper. Okay. So you get this little bit of heat from it almost, but it really gets smoothed out rather quickly because it's got coconut water. Mm -hmm. um, and then it's got like this rummy note and a little bit of leather too. That's unique smelling. You know, a lot of it times is. when you smell something, it reminds me of this, reminds me of yeah. that. That smells It's very different. exotic and it's not your typical tropical scent. Mm -hmm. I feel like there's yeah. enough. Or Interest cheese. added. I like it's it. A great spring scent. Like so, what else have we got? You got something else? Yeah. Um. So let's talk about the new Comme des Garçons. We love Comme des Garçons. Yes. Yeah. This is Comme Dot. And mm -hmm. uh, basically, this scent was meant to capture the allure of a park with um, a bunch of awesome antich. Osmanthus trees in bloom. Ostrich? Ostrich. No, ostrich. 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 <laughs> yes. Sorry. Lots of ostrich trees. <laughs> so. It's not very florally to me. Mm -hmm. um, I mostly get this bitter orange on sort of a woody base, and I think we were talking about this earlier before you came. And it's I get more citrus out of it than anything yeah. else. Yeah, yeah, it's a lot of citrus. Um, I don't think I sprayed. This is the one. Let me spray it. So that bottle kind of yeah matches our attire today. We're in black, using black. Yeah. <laughs> I get citrus too. Yeah, it's very citrusy. Um, it's got. Supposedly it's got some green notes in there, mm -hmm. um, but it's also got bitter orange, of course. I, I definitely smell notes. citrus. I smell, I smell orange blossom. It's, a, it's bitter supposed orange. to have the osmanthus, but again, I really get mostly a bitter citrus and okay. then a woody base. I guess this is one of those you have to definitely spray on definitely, skin. Definitely, definitely. To see it evolve. But it's a few bottles for sure. I know, it is. The bottle that cannot stand up. Yes. No is it one, one of those? It is. Oh, it man. Is. It looks like it could stand. No, I guess, know. Because me, I'll easy. drop it. So let me lay it down before it down. I yes. drop it like I always do. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you for that. Oh, yes. You're welcome. What have you got, Miss Carla? I've got the latest tower scent. Um, okay. Lonesome Rider. Um, this is actually, um, Andy was saying in an interview how it's been almost 11 years mm -hmm. in the making because it's. It builds upon Oris, the limited edition scent he did, which builds upon Lone Star Memory. Okay. So it's kind of the latest addition to his catalog of work. And it's actually an oriental fragrance, but to me, I get so much leather. And mm -hmm. it's interesting because he has, there's elements of the scent that make it an interesting leather. So mm -hmm. um, you have the vetiver and the citrus okay. on the top, well, vetiver in the base, but citrus yeah, on the top, right. which kind of Freshens it up. Give it a whiff. Um, the iris and the rose. It's really sort of a bright. And I, it's, it's a bright leather. color and it's yeah. very smooth. But, and I do feel it, it veers a little bit on the feminine end of the spectrum. Does it? I think mm. so. Yeah. I definitely get leather off this. Initial and you get step. that. You get that tower DNA with the rose. But also Ta tower tower ah tower tower aid. Tower aid. Tower aid. <laughs> But also the amber grease in the uh, base of it gives it a bit of eeriness almost. Mm -hmm. I, I think it's an extraordinary letter. Good stuff. I actually reviewed his uh, newest Tower Bill from Truly last night. Yeah. Awesome. All right. <laughs> so, um, yeah, definitely a, a very multifaceted leather, I guess. Cool. All right, thanks for that. You guys have gotten in the latest from Maison Francis Cartesian. Bacala. Mm -hmm. Ouge 540. I've smelled it on my skin. And I just can't stop thinking about it. Yeah. I don't know why. If I had to review this today, I couldn't. All I know is that it's just stuck it's in my brain. Hard to describe. It's sparkly. It is I mean, sparkly. It's sort of this effervescent champagne-y. Yeah. I almost get like, you know, those vintage lipsticks with that with a bit of sweetness, that almost like it is florally sweet. scent. But I, I, I've said to other people that I think it's quite sweet, and a lot of people don't agree with me, which I... It's not outright sweet, it's not mm -hmm. outright floral, it's just... 
I find it captivating. Oh, I it's really, I really like it. And it lasts, it lasts on my skin for like hours. You don't hear me say that often. Mm. I have sense punch skin. I eat, mm. every, I eat everything. Mine this too. lasts for a good ten hours on my skin. And this is not new for them, but I wanted to speak about it because I really like this one too. It's um, again Maison Maison Francis Cryptijon. It's Aqua Vitae Forte. Mm. I wasn't a big fan of the original, a little too sheer for my taste, but mm. this one, beautiful orange blossom, mm -hmm. very summery, very bright, very bright, and again, last and last and last. Right. Yeah, it's almost like a, a warm skin on sheets in a way. Ah. It has that, it has that like sensuality to mm -hmm. it, but it's still fresh. And so, sweet. ladies, always wonderful to see you. Yes. Thank yeah, you. No problem. Thank you. Thank you. Nice to see you too. Thank you. Yeah. And we'll see you all next time. Take it easy. Bye. All right, you guys, thanks to the generosity of Swissed Lily, we're going to offer one lucky subscriber, US only, please, a sample of each of these fragrances that we discussed today. Still Life in Rio from Olfactive Studio, Maison Francis Kirk Dijon, Apovite Forte, and Baccarat Rouge 440, Comme des Garçons Dat, and Tower Perfumes Lonesome Rider. To enter, all you have to do is go to the Twisted Lily website and write down a fragrance that you haven't tried that you would like to try that's on their website. This is US only. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys real soon. Take care. We tried to do this last week. It didn't work out too well. It was a disaster. But it was a lot of fun and uh, I'm glad to be here again. So yes. what do you got for me ladies? I'd like to see you. All right, so let's talk about um, the new Olfactive Studio. Oh, okay. They don't want us to talk about it. <laughs> um, can you, did you have that? So you got some new stuff in, ladies, yes. right? And you're yeah. going to show me? Yeah. Oh my God, I just, I just lose Carla. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> All you have to do is leave one comment down below with what your, with your, your I don't know, with your something. <laughs> you see how that goes?